I'm Jeff Torch in Las Vegas, Nevada at DEMA 2010 for Advanced Diver Magazine and ReviewTheWorld.com and I'm talking with Chris DeFelice from Patriot 3 Maritime. And Chris, what is this? This is the uh, next generation undersea warfare uh, concept uh, that we have here at DEMA. Uh, it's basically a full kit of uh, propulsion with a uh, uh, dive kit and uh, rebreather mod. looking at right here? Uh, this is the uh, platform for the next generation undersea warfighter. Uh, it's a compliant 55 pound lift uh, front mount BC which allows for a mandatory uh, unconscious profile at the surface. Um, what we've been able to do is create a load bearing system on the back which not only can accommodate another cylinder in a hydration system but it completely balances the front uh, of the system. Um, very important here is the fact that we do have a propulsion system which has a back mounted battery pack which keeps everything nice and clean on the back um, and allows us full uh, bailout capability and a rebreather module on the front. Now this is almost exclusively for military use. Uh, this, th this model is absolutely uh, exclusive for military use. Um, the rebreather module does clip off and it can be uh, transformed into a open circuit system uh, for rapid rescue for uh, uh, go uh, government agencies, fire departments, police departments. Uh, that's being used already in Homeland Security, Border Patrol, you know, all, all over across the board. Are you getting a lot of people stopping by and asking about this? Oh yeah, this has been definitely one of the highlights here, you know, for the show for us. And we're, you know, we feel uh, very proud to be at DEMA 2010 to showcase this technology. Chris, this is the rebreather module here? Uh, yes, it is. It's a complete module uh, that has a breathing bag. Uh, and also two uh, uh, cartridges, extender cartridges fit right inside the breathing bag. It's, it's one complete module, and the module, uh, when it's taken off of the, the unit, it's about basically a small square pack, just like this here. So essentially a, a diver using this could just strip this off and then just continue with what he was doing. That's correct. Yeah, there's three um, FastX Quick Connects that will allow this whole unit to come right off. And you can see underneath there we've got, our, we've got a comm that's already set up. Ready to go. Yeah, and this is you know really a, a, kind of one of the most interesting innovations about the whole undersea warfare uh, fighter concept is that it's completely changeable for the mission, and uh, the extender cartridges give us the opportunity to take extra modules, which is I think important in the grand scheme of things for uh, for safety and for extended durations. Excellent. Good. Chris, obviously one of the most stunning features of this entire rig is that it, there is a pistol right here in the front. What's the idea behind that? Well, I, Jeff, that's a great question. We get that question all the time. Um, the main reason we have a weapon carrier cap capability on the front is uh, it's just the, the tank actually becomes this perfect solid platform uh, for mounting things like this. And there's other versions where we got shears and, and whatnot. Um, folks that are doing hull, uh, hull checks that are actually going into some of the semi-submersibles um, they use this basically as, a, as their bailout system. Uh, they, they like the fact that it's nice and clean with their body for getting through small spaces. And uh, you know, obviously weapons don't fire underwater, but there's uh, many weapons that, are, that, that law enforcement and military uses that are uh, uh, water resistant that they can use, like Glock 19s for instance. Even salt water? Even salt water, yes. And uh, I just want to mention that this is a universal dive profile system, and it's also universal Fit, which means that we, we never know exactly how, you know, what, what, what its ultimate intended use is, and we just want to make it so there's maximum capability to do whatever the operator needs to, to perform their mission. Very, very interesting. We've been talking with Chris DeFelice from Patriot 3 Maritime. I'm Jeff Tourish in DEMA 2010 in Las Vegas, Nevada for ReRootTheWorld.com and Advanced Diver Magazine.